we have here's a fifty dollar Canadian maple leaf one ounce gold coin This is crap. I gotta stay warmed up for the uh, auctions when we get back to them. There. Gotta stay in practice. These stag on like servers or whatever, they're heavy as can be. There's gotta be some scrap value. And uh airsoft again. I mean it's just chock full of stuff. That's gonna be my clothes section. I'm gonna have all the pants, shirts, coats, summer, winter, everything, kids, adults. It's going to take me this whole lockdown time, but I'm going to get all this stuff sorted, or at least mostly done. Maybe always all the way done. These are all been hung up. This just, there's money. This I'll give you a close look of this death pile I'm offering up here. If anybody's interested, I don't know everything that's in here. It's just going to be one of these. What you can see is what you get kind of thing. really going to prep everything here to get ready for the next round of auctions if they come but they're going to come but anyway gotta slow this thing down maybe i'll just slow it down in the, in the video so anyway i can't tell you how many pair of shoes are in here there's more back there there's no telling. I don't even remember. I don't think there's any gold back there, but because that's what I do. I I go for gold. That's why I'm a stacker. Stacker. So all this can go with it too. Uh, yeah. Great speakers. We got electronics that we could dabble as far as working deals that could be part of it too we can see what we can we can put a package together of a deal you want to make right now I'm looking to move bulk it's not really a money thing although I do want a fair but I want to make sure that whoever does buy this has room to make a good profit to make them want to do this so Jack Daniels. <laughs> oh boy. Anyway, guys, we uh, got a little bit of firepower out here just in case we get blindsided. Don't think we're going to. At any rate, going through storage units for the past nine and a half years, this is the goal that I've come up with. I've got every bit of it. I'm, a, as you know, I'm a stacker. I've got a lot of bullion, but I don't keep it at home. But this I do. I have this. This is all the scrap. I think you remember that episode. Look at that. This is all the scrap. I hope this shows up very well. 
let's see. Oh yeah. Here's over a thousand dollars right here. Hope this shows well. Gold. Gold. There's probably in this box, I guess at least 15 grand in this box. Here's some gold rings. I don't think this is showing up very good. See if I can get the. Let's try something. I don't think that works. I think this. I got to keep the zoom off. Maybe I'll try another camera. And here you have tenth of an ounce. And here's a quarter ounce. Here's a very small. It says. Dos pesos. This is an old Mexican gold coin. Uh, here's a one ounce gold bullion. St. Gaudens style. Another maple leaf. So these are getting dropped off today in a very safe location. We'll put it with the rest. Here's another one. Let's see if I can show these a little better. This is just terrible. I, so the Canadian, the Canadian maple leaves are pretty. I like the American coins better. There's another one ounce Canadian. I wish I could get this showing better. So anyway. I just wanted to show you some of these things. These are what you never find these in storage units. I'm sure it's been done, but I have not found gold coins in a storage unit. I have not found the first one yet. I have found plenty of gold. South Africa. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, that's a panda. That's a Chinese gold coin. And another ounce. They're beautiful coins. Look at that. Here's a $20, $1904, 20 gold piece. Isn't that beautiful? Here's a quarter ounce in the same style. And then you got the little coins. Here's a five dollar gold piece. Eighteen ninety seven. There's picking it up. Let's see the back of this. These are beautiful. So I gotta go put put these in storage today. Show you this. Isn't that pretty. Gold, gold, gold. Another watch. Another gold watch. Isn't that beautiful? Gold watch. Gold watch.
I don't think that's showing up very well. I'll let you know here. I'm gonna. Don't think this is working right. Let's see if I can get that to come in properly. I think it's probably better down here. You reckon? Gold chains. Gold diamonds. Gold. Beautiful. Nine years of gold. Look at this. This one is expensive. Gold. I think this is the one you see in the beginning of the video where I'm doing <laughs> We can get some of the carrot marks. See if you can see that. I don't know if that's going to show up or not. Yeah, we're looking at some land out in Shelbyville, guys. Um, I am seriously looking. If I get that, the reason I think we're going to get it is because my wife's in on it. She actually is pushing me to do it. So if we get that, I'm going to probably have a place to drop off some marginal product. I'm going to have them. Look at this beautiful. Oh, my God. I don't think it's showing very well. I'm going to do the best I can with this, and we're going to learn as we go here on this YouTube thing. We've got some white gold in here. Look at all this gold. Nine years. I bet some of you are laughing, saying, is that all you got? Well, guys, I never said you found a lot of it in these storage units. I said you find some here and there in about 40% of them. And, uh, And then you just collect it over the years and it goes up in value or it goes down in value, but overall it always holds value. Gold is always going to have value. So I don't sell any gold. This is white gold here. This is uh, another class ring. White gold. Ten carat. Beautiful. There's a couple of bands. I think there's one stuck inside the other one. I can't get it out. There it goes. It's actually a set. You got a his and hers bands. Well, that was a nice find. I remember that. Chains. Where's that long chain I found in the... God, they're all... Cl Here's my first gold watch I found in a storage unit. It looks like a $20 gold piece. That's how it's designed. That's a nice $1,000 find right there. I don't know if that's going to show up very good. I'm not happy about the way this camera's focusing in. More rings. Diamond chips. Sorry, guys. It's just beautiful stuff. Look at that big guy. That's probably like 1200 bucks right there. Maybe more than that now. Oh, that's gold. It's 58% of what is on this watch is all gold. It's a lot of weight. 
There's another gold band. We got at least a hundred of these. Just all kinds. I just thought it might be interesting to show you guys these. And yeah, I brought my pistol out here just in case. You know, gold. Let's see if there's any other individual pieces. It's hard for me to get this. I have this in a very sophisticated place, and it's very hard to get to. So I, it's taken me like a 40 minutes to get this set up today. I don't know if this is showing very well. Let's see. I'll show you some more. Showed you that one. Oh yeah, I remember this one. Got that in a little five by five. That's three hundred dollars plus in gold right there. Just that one. I don't think this is showing real well. I just want to show you what you get over the years buying storage units. And I'm not a heavy volume buyer by any means. I try to target the ones I like and get the ones I like. And as you can see I get my share. I'm not like storage option pirate and find tons of this stuff. I just <laughs> just just kidding pirate. He's a good guy. You need to watch his channel. I'm sure y'all probably do. Everybody knows him. Nobody knows who I am but that's okay. We're trying here. I don't think this is showing real well, guys. So, anyway, I gotta get this back in the vault. I just wanted to show you guys some of the pieces. I just wish this was showing better. I'm not real happy with the camera quality here. I hope I can use this. All right. Well, anyway, nine years, this is the gold. I haven't showed you the silver, but quite a bit of that too. Cuff links. White gold. It's one thing to have it, you have to protect it. So. <clears throat> So anyway guys, just thought I'd show you a few of those things. Um, I'm with the same boat as everybody else. You know, there's most of the states are, are on lockdown. I haven't bought a storage unit going on three weeks. I'm having that kind of withdrawal. <laughs> So we hope to get back to that soon. I'm getting the building cleaned out. There's Douglas coming out of there. Oh, he sees a bird. So anyway, if you like this video, hit the thumb and go ahead and subscribe. I have, uh, believe this or not, 78% of the people that watch my channel are not subscribed. <laughs> Jesus. I want to give my thanks to those 22%.